Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new here. So I'm bringing you a huge Costco haul today. This is a bonus video this week. I haven't been to Costco in quite some time, and we got a ton of stuff, tons of food, snacks, dinner ideas. So I'm gonna share that with you guys here in just a few seconds, but thank you so much for being here. Make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit that thumbs up, and let's get into this very large Costco haul. Okay, so here is the haul all line, laid out on the island. Guys, this is a huge haul. We haven't been to Costco in quite some time, so let's just get right into it because it's probably going to take us a little while. I will have the prices pop up at the bottom of the screen for you, and let's just get into it. In no particular order, I kind of just laid it all out. I tried to keep some stuff like in the right category, but... You know, it is what it is. Okay, so the first thing, I ended up getting some Eclipse gum. So I like to keep these in my car. My husband likes to keep them at his desk at work or anything like that. So this is a variety with four, two spearmints, one winter frost, and one polar ice. We had to get some ketchup. We were running low. My daughter loves ketchup. Um, and it's just kind of like a staple that we keep in the house. And I haven't bought it in some time. So we got some of that. These are my kids' favorites snacks I've shown them before these were um, it's so much cheaper to buy them like this at Costco than to get them individually at Kroger so I went ahead and got this 16 pack of the Nutella um, breadsticks so we have been on my husband has been making the kids pancakes every morning so we've been going through the syrup so we ended up getting this that's a lot of syrup y'all log cabin um, original syrup um, so they can eat these with their waffles, their pancakes, or whatever, and it lasts forever. So this will last us for a very long time. I ended up getting the kids um, some chip snacks for their lunches, Doritos, Cheetos, uh, three different types of the Lay's chips, and then Fritos. Also, this Wolf Brand Chili, my kids have been loving chili dogs. So this is a really easy lunch for your kids if you need it. Joe just brought the dogs back in if that's what you're hearing. Um, and they had a six pack of this. So this is like an easy lunch. You can do nachos, you can do chili dogs, whatever, the kids really like it. I got this for me, y'all I was hungry when we were at Costco and they had this Girl Scout Thin Mint Chocolate Covered Almonds. Look how delicious those look. Whenever I get a sweet tooth, I like to have something like this that I can just grab quickly. And Thin Mints are my favorite cookie of all time. So I think those are gonna be delicious. Um, my daughter loves chocolate milk, and if y'all have ever bought chocolate milk individually, we were looking at the like Horizon Organic individual chocolate milks, and it was like $20 for those. So we went the Nesquik route, and she can make her own chocolate milk herself. She'll probably like it better this way, because she likes doing things on her own right now. So we ended up getting her that. Organic applesauce. Usually I do the go-go squeezes, but when we go to Costco, I grab this, because they like the Kirkland brand too, and it's a lot cheaper. Um, some Topo Chico's. I haven't had these in forever. Kroger doesn't have them. Every time I do a pickup order, they have to substitute it for something else. And Costco did, so I went ahead and got some of those. And our uh, sauces. Sorry, this is turned the wrong direction. So we got a ton of pasta. We always grab some pasta when we go to Costco. My kids love pasta. It's easy dinners. We'll do like meatballs, spaghetti and meatballs. We got this brand and we also got the Rayos brand. So this one is really, really good. It's just a little more expensive. And this one I think was $9.69 and it came with four. And I think this one, I think it was like $12 or something like that. I'll have the prices posted on the screen for you. But we end up getting both because we will do, the kids will have pasta like three times a week with sauce, with meatballs, um, with meat sauce, just plain. So we wanna make sure we have enough of this on hand for them. To go along with our pancakes in the morning that my husband had been making the kids, we got some chocolate chips that he can add into them. Lexi will eat these just as a snack too. So we just got this big bag, the Kirkwood's brand of chocolate chips. We got some grapes. These look really good. I look, Costco has really, really good produce. So I tried to grab some while I'm there. So we got these grapes. We got some Ready Whip that comes in a three pack. And my kid's favorite snack is cut up strawberries. So we got some of those, two packs actually with um, Cool Whip or Ready Whip on top of it. So it's a somewhat healthy snack and they really like it. So I wanted to make sure that we have some on hand. I got some asparagus to cook. Um, we put it in the oven and we like bake it. It's really good. And some cucumbers to snack on or to make a salad with. My son loves these organic hard boiled eggs. They're individually packed so I can put them in his lunch or he can have some for breakfast, a quick easy breakfast. 
And then my daughter, this is her favorite cheese snacks. These are really expensive. I don't know why they are so expensive, but she likes them and they're perfect for her snacks. So I went ahead and got her some of the Baby Bell cheeses. I saw this Mateo salsa. I don't, I think someone on here has gotten this before and they said it's really good. So it's a very large jar that will last us forever and it would go good on, we do taco night on Tuesdays or even breakfast tacos, even just chips and salsa. So I got this to try. There's the strawberries. And we ended up getting some meat from Costco as well. This is the chicken tenderloins. And then the chicken breast. It comes in like a six pack and you can just cut them and individually cook them whenever you're ready. Grillo's pickles. This is my favorite thing to get at Costco. I get it every time we go and it lasts just a few days. It's so, they're like the best pickles. Dill, dill chips, but they're so good. A thing of bananas for my son. We have gotten back to using our coffee machine over there, if you've seen it in some of my videos and on Instagram, and it takes whole beans, so it grinds the bean for you. So we ended up getting this brand espresso um, coffee, and we're gonna mix it with, we have like a medium roast that we kind of mix it in to make it a little stronger. This is the pancakes that we got. This is gonna last forever, but he literally makes them every weekend, twice a week, so. Um, we wanted to make sure we had enough, so they really like it. We're gonna add the chocolate chip to these or blueberries. You could literally do, my son likes them uh, plain. So that's what we're doing with those. We've got a Caesar salad just for an easy lunch. These were really good. We sp I had these at my sister-in-law's house. I think it was for New Year's and she got them from Costco. So I wanted to go ahead and pick some of these up too. These chicken and cheese flautas, they are so good. And you could even dip them in that salsa over there, which would be really, really yummy. My daughter likes these too. So we got some of these. And then we kind of got, um, I don't want to say like a cheaper brand of it, or like, but like they're smaller. So the El Monterey, Taquitos, Black Bean and Cheese. We're very, we like to do snacks a lot on the weekends, not like like full dinners. We'll just do some snackies, appetizer type things. So we found these Ling Ling pot stickers, pot stickers, chicken and vegetables, and we will steam these or you can sear them like on a, in a frying pan. And then we got some wings, the classic buffalo style to put into the air fryer. I also got these egg witch turkey and sausage sandwiches. I think Kristen, um, her channel is Kristen Marie. I, I think she shared these or maybe it was on her Instagram, but she said they're really good and they're 17 grams of protein. So we're going to try those. I found these lip balms. How, do, how, how do you say this brand? EOS evolution of smooth is what it stands for, but it is cold season here. And that when that cold wind hits your lips, they get so chapped. My kids have chapped lips all winter long. So this is plenty that I can distribute to each of them. Um, vanilla bean, mango, watermelon and coconut milk. I got some more Swiffer dusters because y'all know this house gets dusty. And these are the makeup wipes that me and my daughter use, the Neutrogena. It comes with four of the 25, let's see if it'll focus. It's not, it wants to focus on the tacos. There we go, four 25 packs, then one 25 count of the Hydra Boost ultra soft cleansing and then two of these like travel sizes which is perfect because we are going on a trip recent soon so i can bring those with me we found these mini tacos my daughter will love these she likes tacos and these you can throw in the air fryer you can heat them up in the oven super easy dinner or snack after school snack whatever you need these steamed dumplings for our appetizer and snacks on the weekends they look so good you can basically steam them in the tray that they're already in so i will let y'all know how those end up tasting we got the Spanish Queen Olives, two huge jars, some mozzarella sticks, those are for my daughter, she loves those. Let me walk around on this side. My husband saw these loaded baked potato soups while we were roaming the aisles and it looks so good and it's perfect for a cold weather night, easy dinner, whenever we have baseball or something really late, we can just pop this on and heat it up on the stove and then put some cheese and uh, bacon bits on top that look really good, so we got that. We ended up getting some fish, so we will do this. We'll try to do this twice a week. This is the wild sockeye salmon, and my husband will cut these up and then vacuum seal them and put them in the freezer. And this is wild cod. He makes this really delicious cod recipe. I don't know how he does it. I don't really know how to cook, but he does really good. And then we picked up some steaks, so these we will cut in half. 
and that'll end up being three meals for us. We'll freeze some and then cook some. Topo Chico. I think that's it, you guys. So this was a huge Costco haul, y'all. One of our biggest ones. And lots of snackies, lots of fun, easy dinner ideas. So now I gotta put it all hey, up. guys, that is the end of our Costco haul video. I was gonna film putting all that away, but I made my kids do it and they don't like being on camera. So it's okay, at least I didn't have to do it. Thank you so much for being here and watching today. I hope you got some ideas if you're wanting to go to Costco anytime soon. Um, they had some great deals on a ton of stuff and as you saw earlier we got a ton of stuff so thanks for being here make sure you're subscribed and i'll see you guys on the next one bye